What's up Marvel fans, this is Dan Series, and in this video I'm going to be talking about some two new posters we got for Avengers Infinity War and Ant-Man and the Wasp. So, not just long ago, I just did my video on the um, Ant-Man and the Wasp and Captain Marvel, that news for the San Diego Comic Con. And now I've got another one here, and in the um, that video I said about the, about they might reveal another Infinity, Infinity War poster. And looks like they did. They no, they just released it a couple of minutes ago. So let's get into this then. What's going on here? So first off, it's the Avengers Infinity War poster. So on there, the characters we got on there is uh, we got Groot as a teenager. Looks like that's teenage Groot. We got Rocket. Um, he doesn't look different. Thor, nothing much different. He's got this rather lot look. Loki. Then we got Drax. The both of them look the same. Also, Star Lord looks like he's got nothing different. Vision's there, no new look to him. Scarlet Witch, um, I can't see if she's wearing her costume or is that just normal clothes she's wearing. The Ness, we got Falcon. Now that's a big one because we can see Falcon and he's got his costume on. So looks like he must have got his costume back after Cap broke them out. And another one, we got Black Widow, and it's what I heard that what she had in the trailer, and she actually has blonde hair in the film, so, wow, that's really interesting, I mean, like, huh, I've never seen Black Widow with a different colour before, a different hair colour, and well, I've always known as her having red hair, but now in this, they've changed it, so, well, one thing I've said before, I think the reason maybe she's wearing it, because, think about it, because, She's not on Iron Man's side anymore because she did betray him in Civil War. And because she's on the one, maybe she changed her hairstyle so the government or the people out of the battle would not recognise her. So I could say that. And then last but not least, character Captain America. Well, who was Captain America? Yeah, Steve Rogers. And whoa, he looks very different. It's what they said when it was in the trailer. Cab with a big with beard. And that's pretty cool. And it looks like here, he's wearing the costume he wore in Civil War, but there's a lot of change. Like, one, it looks like that it's gone a bit darker. Like, I think it's turned black. I don't know if that's the, that's the picture or what it is. But anyway, on there, uh, you can see that. You can see he's took the star out of the front and the, assemb and the A symbol there. But the only thing that remains is just the outlines on this. So, oh... That's really interesting. So he's took them off. But with it as well. So is he going to be no man, no mad in the film? Because I did bring that up. Not in the last um, video when I was on about the beginning. But in the, well, yesterday's one. I meant that I talked about is he going to become no mad in this film? And maybe he is. Maybe he's going to become no mad in the film. So ooh, that would be interesting. Really interesting. And now, let's move on to the last one. And this is a good one. Ant-Man and the Wasp. Now, this one's really interesting that I've got to discuss about. But let me explain who's on the poster first. So first, we got Scott Lane. One with his, just his face. And then another one, him in his costume. And his Ant-Man costume. But in this picture, he's Giant Man. So yeah, it looks like he will be Giant Man again in this film. Then we got Hope. And then we got her again in her costume. And what she's doing here is, you see her small, then she turns big. She punches a guy, with, no, kicks a guy, and then turns small again. So, oh, that would be pretty cool. Then we got Hank Pym. I mean, yeah, Hank Pym. Now, the one by Scott Lane, but the face of, you know, Scott Lane's face without the um, mask on. You can see that there's a girl by him, and I can't recognise who that is. I mean... I don't, is that supposed to be his daughter? Because I keep thinking, is that his daughter? Or is that one of the new characters? I can't really tell. And we, you've got his, Scott Lane's best mate. Um, the one who, uh, who, was, who was at the beginning when he was, you know, when Scott Lane came out of prison. Yeah, he's back. And what, part of the picture, you can see when it, Scott Lane, as giant man, punches a helicopter. And also, you got a bunch of soldiers and a tank there. So... Okay, so first, let's discuss about that first then, who they're fighting. Now, I'm trying to think first, who are these guys then, and who are they fighting? Well, as I said in my last video, we've got a character called Ghost. 
Now, I'm sure it's the ghost that I, I did discuss in that video, but... Ghost is a character who's an enemy in Iron Man, but... The person in there, we found out now, it's a female. Now, I still don't know if if they're changing the character to a female, or it might be the daughter of the character, but I don't know. But I think it could be her minions. Maybe she builds, like, a, a soldier army group in the film. I don't know. I'm not pretty sure. Uh, but... I wouldn't think it's Hydra, because I don't think Hydra are making a return anytime soon in the films. I don't think so. Now, um, Wasp. Um, costume, uh, not very much different. It's something we've seen in the end of the credit, end of the credit scene of Ant-Man and what we've seen lately. Now, Ant-Man's costume. Um, the body's the similar to the Civil War costume, but the difference I can see here is, in the Civil War um, film... The belt, you know, the circle belt he had in, in the first film, it wasn't there. But now he's got it back on. So that's interesting. Um, the legs, I think it's the same. Or they might have gone back to the very first costume of the Ant-Man from Ant-Man 1. The first Ant-Man. I think, I don't know. Now the mask. The mask is changed. A well, let's say it's changed. I mean, what they've done is, it's like they've got the first Ant-Man mask and the one from Civil War and combine them together. So you got like uh, the mouth from the first Ant Man film, uh, the headpiece here from Civil War, the red lines from the Ant Man, and the little pointy ears around there from the Civil War. So, whoa, that is pretty um, different. Pretty, pretty different. Now, um, I just like Hank Pym. Um, he looks very similar. He just looks the same with face wise. Uh, Ant Man's mate. Um, nothing much different. He's got the beard, the mustache here, and that little beard here again. So nothing's changed. Now the girl there, uh, as I said, I'm not pretty sure if that's supposed to be his daughter or a new character. But uh, uh well, let's have a quick closer look. Uh, um, I don't know. I think it's his daughter. Uh, I'm not pretty sure, but I would just have to um. Well, I'll have a way to see if they, you know, if they say that, oh, his daughter's back in the film. So, um, yeah, that's it really, guys. That's, um, that's all from this one. So, if you want to see the posters for yourself, they'll be down on me Marvel, Cinematic, Marvel Cinematic Universe page down in the description below. Um, leave your comments down below. What do you think of these pictures? What do you think of the Civil War one? I mean, Avengers Infinity War one and the Ant-Man one. And let's discuss about these two. What do you like about them? And what do you think? You, what do you like about the Ant Man and the Wasp one? Let's discuss about it, and also theories about it with it. Also, give this a thumbs up. Uh, share this out to your friends so we get more viewers and subscribers. And if you're new to this channel, this is what I do. I do Marvel and Transformers Cinematic Universe news. I do trailers, clips, TV spots, and I also do spoiler reviews when the films come out. Uh, trailers and clips when they come out, I do those. TV spots, I tend to avoid the spoiler ones because they tend to spoil, you know, the um, film, really. And I don't want to see them before the film's out. And last but not least, if you want to see me last Marvel video, well, the one I was on about at the beginning, click here. My channel, click here. Make sure you click the bell so you can be notified when me new videos are up. And here, jump to see my last Transformers video. And uh, yeah, that's it really, guys. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching and see you guys soon. Peace.